Hi everybody, this is our fifth Q&A and today's topic is places where you can get raw vegan recipes online. So, what are the most famous raw vegan recipe websites? Who are the most famous raw vegan chefs on YouTube? Who do I follow and what have I learned from them? And how do I start making my own recipes? So, I chose um, three of each of the first ones because otherwise this video would go on forever and ever. And the links to everything I say are in the description below. Okay, so let's get started. What are the most famous raw vegan websites? So possibly the most famous one is The Rotarian. Um, so Lara Jane started a food blog in 2009 as part of her own transformation and it now has apps, it has books, and she has a lot of followers. Um, her recipes are very uh, high level. Um, another one is um, This Ross and Vegan Life. So Emily Fenu started this as a teenager and her work has since been featured on opera.com, it has been featured on Elle magazine and also in the Huffington Post. And One Green Planet. So the reason this was my third choice um, is because um, Neil Zakaria and Preeta Sinha did not just start uh, a website that has raw vegan recipes on it. They were thinking about a more global concept on how our food affects our economy, how it affects our ecology. And I found that very inspiring that they came from that perspective and then they built from there. And they have a lot of resources and some of them are raw vegan recipes. So that's why they were um, my third choice. Of course there are many others and I encourage you to write your own below, tell us who you follow so we can all learn. Who are the most famous raw vegan chefs on YouTube? So number one, Foley Rock Christina, Christina Carilla Bacarm. She started when she was 19, she's been at it for 11 years. Um, her story is she had to cure hypoglycemia and she was a student at the time and it was not easy and she had to sometimes sneak around, hide, hide bananas, get um, some of her um, notes from her doctors and she wanted to eat organic and in order to afford that she had to find a way to buy food in bulk and that's when she started her um, raw vegan co-op, raw food and granic, which then turned into um, recipes and uh, a website and her YouTube channel and her books and her great work that's inspired millions of people. Rovana. So, Yovana Mendoza um, started to change her life in 2013. Now, she was more of this party animal, which of course can work great with a raw vegan diet, um, only she was not very conscious about making healthy choices when it came to how her life fits with her body needs. And she has done some very serious um, detoxification, including almost a month of water fasting. She has many recipes. She's now following um, a, a high raw vegan diet. Um, she actually started fully raw. And she's also been an inspiration um, to millions of followers. Andrea Cox. So um, Andrea Cox is a bit different than the other two. She's a health coach and she actually started as a fitness model. So she's made a trans transition in her life and she's made a transformation um, and she shares many recipes. Uh, she's a bit different when she talks about recipes. Um, I found one of her recipes where she actually talks about the experience she had in the marketplace where she bought the ingredients. And I find that kind of nice because it's down to earth and it's telling you about the day-to-day -day of her life and um, I found that easy to relate to. So, who do I follow? Um, I love Laura Miller. Uh, she actually had her own raw vegan restaurant and then she started um, this YouTube series with Testmate and she made raw and vegan um, recipes and then it started um, going back to her own channel and making her own raw vegan book. She's got a great sense of humor. I've learned a lot from her about tastes and textures. Um, the tip that I've linked below is how to make um, an egg type um, ingredient, so something that has that 
texture out of flax seeds and water. So um, I found her to be quite an inspiration. And my number one, Marcus Rotkrantz and Cara Brockman and her brother Giuliano Brockman. So Giuliano and Cara started one of the first raw vegan uh, restaurants in the world. Um, they had very little funding and they were sensational. Their recipes are targeted, I think maybe both my resources that I like the most um, as chefs are targeted at a regular audience. So people like me who, I was cooking for 25 years before I went raw vegan and, and I couldn't live without that, um, that sensation of food. And I needed something that was more, that was more than a smoothie or a salad. And they had to cater to that audience. They had to cater to people like me. And I've learned a lot from them um, on how to make raw vegan pizza, how to make something that would be exactly like pasta and also have the texture of pasta, but it would be made out of zucchini, which is what I'm linking below. So um, Cara shows how to take um, a zucchini, which is crunchy and um, a bit stiff, and using simple ingredients, olive oil and salt, and a little bit of marinating, turn it into something that behaves exactly like regular pasta. So, um, for all the people who have inspired me, thank you very much. You've been amazing. Um, why did I start making my own recipes? So, I follow the Dr. Mars Fully Raw Vegan Diet. And on this diet, the focus is a lot more on detox, and we have very strict food combination rules. And I found that whenever I tried to make a recipe, I would have to convert it anyhow. I would have to change it so much that it would become a new recipe. And then I would have my own ideas on how to alter the taste a bit. And at some point I said, well, why don't I try this? Why don't I become a chef? Someone who other people uses the recipe. And it was a great challenge. I'm still learning a lot. I have quite a few failures. Um, but I love the experimenting and I definitely love the successes. Um, so, as usual, always happy to share them with you, happy to share my recipes. Please subscribe. I'll meet you in our new Q&A um, in a couple of weeks again. Um, and also, with this video, please share who you're following. I think we're done here. Have an amazing day and see you in the next recipe and Q&A.